So here we go. Hanser Alberto making his eighth appearance this season. He already set the record for most appearances by a non-pitcher in a single season when he had his seventh appearance yesterday. And that does not include two-way players like Shohei Otani or Brooks Kieschnick. But here's Hanser pitching out of the stretch. He gets focused, a little spit right here. And then he gets a sign from Barnes. Probably that unknown pitch that he's been throwing this season. Bruh. And then Grisham hits a fly ball to left field. And Hanser's best friend, Joey Gallo, makes the catch. Joy, joy, yes, papa, eating sugar, no, papa, tell me lies, no, papa, open your mouth, ah, ah, ah. And then with one out, Josh Bell at the plate. Hanser gets a not-so-fast ball to land at the bottom of the zone for a strike one. And on the 0-1 pitch, he misses outside for ball one. This lady's fanning herself down because she's watching the hottest reliever on the planet. Then Hanser comes setting on the 1-1 pitch. Josh Bell hits a foul ball, and Hanser does a little dance right there. A little Hanser the dancer action on the mound. And then here's Yancy Almonte and Bruce Dar Gratterall. They're locked in. Look at the focus on Bruce Dar. Gratterall. He knows he's one strike away from his first career strikeout. And then on the one-two pitch, here's Hanser to the plate, and he gets the called strike three on the outside corner for his first career strikeout. A great frame job there by Austin Barnes. You see Josh Bell's reaction kind of tilts his head back like, I don't know about that. He strikes out on a 68-mile-per-hour fastball on the corner. Josh Bell might just want to announce his retirement right after this game. And how about the um, ringing him up with the reverse K and he hits him with the aggressive strike three call and Alberto says hey I'll make the call for you he does the sign two boom then we get some more Hanser the Dancer getting down on the mound. Hold me closer, tiny Hanser. The Dodgers dugout is loving it. Bruce Dar Gratterall's like, yeah, pounds it. Boom, boom. Yancy Almonte, he's pointing. He's smiling. And they want the ball. They're calling for the ball. Bruce Dar whistles for it. Get us that ball. Authenticate that. Send it straight to Cooperstown. This guy's smiling. This lady's probably texting her friend, hey, the Padres won the trade deadline. That's probably about all they're going to win this season. Or she's probably doing a wordle. Or she's probably texting her friend that she's watching Mariana Rivera on the mound. Bruh. And then here's Hanser back to work to face Will Myers. First pitch is high for ball one. They're laughing. They're still loving it in the dugout. The lady, she put her phone away. And she looks like she's thinking, I cannot believe this guy is making me stay for the final out in a 12-1 to blowout. What? And then on the 1-0, he misses high again. And we're seven pitches in, and Hanser is laboring out there. You see he takes off his hat. He wipes his forehead. And then on the 2-0 count, he misses inside for ball three. Then on the 3-0, he gets a strike at the top of the zone. And then on the 3-1, Hanser gets Myers to ground a short. Nice backhanded play by Trey Turner. Makes a strong throw to get the final out. And then Hanser calls for the ball, and he finally gets it. And he kisses it, points to the sky. Little fist bump. Yeah! Yeah, little five for Austin Barnes, little hug right there. And the legend of Hanser Alberto continues. How about this? In eight games for the Dodgers this season, Alberto has a 3-3-8 ERA. Josh Hader in eight games for the Padres after being traded to San Diego has a 19-06 ERA. You've got Babe Ruth, Shohei Otani, and Hanser Alberto. I'm going to tell my kids this was Mariano Rivera. Hanser Bruh. Alberto, he's been great for the Dodgers this season. His teammates love him. He keeps the clubhouse loose. And you see the joy that he plays with, that he brings into that Dodgers dugout. It's so refreshing. Just like a crisp and refreshing Yo, Jim Beam highball seltzer. Look, if I was Hanser Alberto and I was a two-way player having to play on the field, having a pitch, I would want to refresh myself after the game with a Jim Beam highball seltzer. Please drink responsibly. But let me know down below in the comment section how big of an impact has Hanser Alberto had on the the Dodgers team chemistry this season. How important do you think that is to a team's overall success? Let me know down below. My name is Doug McCain. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at DMAC underscore LA. For our latest Dodgers news, rumors, high videos, breakdowns, and more all season long, be sure to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell. And if you want to see us post even more Dodgers content, smash that like button. And until next time, think blue, bleed blue, and I'm out.